Hello gorgeous Aries and welcome to your weekly reading. I hope you're all doing really well. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Aries. If your Sun sign doesn't resonate you might like to check out your Moon sign or your Rising sign and for love and romance your Venus sign because often these readings contain messages which are important to you at this time as well. So it looks like that card there wants to stay there for you Aries so that will be your card for that deck. And be sure to check in with your own intuition throughout the reading because this is how Spirit speaks to you directly. And Spirit does want to speak to you directly throughout this reading. So take notice of any signs, symbols or any messages on the cards that really resonate for you at this time and have meaning for you. Let's take a look at your first message. We have the energy of expansion this week. Spread your wings and soar. Share your message and shine your light. Show the world what you're made of. This is you really coming into your own in some way, Aries. I really love this energy for you. This means there's an expansion in your life in some way. I'm seeing that you're going to feel that it is a breath of fresh air coming toward you. It seems like troubles are put behind you. There is an energy here of you welcoming this energy in. So you may be this week going through some kind of change and it may be a change in circumstances or maybe a change in mindset. It might be something else. You'll have to place this energy and you'll know if it resonates for you or not. And this is a very good energy and I feel that you're going to welcome it. So I love that for you Aries. You're ready to take flight with something this week. We have the energy of abundance, another beautiful card in energy. It really feels like to me this week, Aries, that you're going to be, your cup is going to be full here. You're receiving what you have wanted to receive for some time. I am grateful for the abundance nature and the universe provide in my life. So you're really looking to universal source energy. And you're aware that your abundance ultimately comes from that source and not from yourself or other people. There's definitely a connection here from you to spirit. And I just love this. Connecting into nature is also coming through. So you may find that you want to get outdoors. You want to be in nature. You want to meditate outdoors or in nature or with um, plants or animals around you. So I do feel that that energy is here for the week as well. A gratefulness for the abundance that you have. You're not taking this for granted. Whatever this is, this expansion is Aries. You're not taking it for granted. Let's take a look at this card here. You're going to enjoy the journey this week. So that's really nice. Or well, Spirit is saying no matter what happens this week, enjoy the journey as much as you can. Keep a positive frame of mind. And it's important to stay present and flexible. Many changes are going on for you and around you. These changes are not only good, but necessary. Bring your awareness into the now rather than focusing on the past or the future. So very much thinking about the present moment Aries and not having too much of your thoughts going to the past or to the future. Just stay in the moment this week and it's going to serve you the best. Let's take a look at this card here. We have the energy of play. So this is a really nice energy to be connected into abundance. You're going to feel abundant. You're going to see abundance come through in your life and, you, and you're grateful for that. And you're going to feel joyful and playful. Beloved one, it's time to set aside work for a while. Don't worry, we will oversee your responsibilities to their completion. Playfulness, gaiety and laughter will lift your energy so that you'll return to work with a renewed perspective and heightened energy. You might be taking some time off work or perhaps you recently have and you're going to go back into your work life or your business and you're going to feel renewed. You're going to have a sense of enthusiasm once again. So it's time to set aside work for a while. Try and get everything done um, before the deadline. Don't procrastinate. Get things done this week, Aries, because you're going to move into a good energy if this is the case. We have the world energy. This is nice. This means that there is a cycle that's completing in your, in your world right now. Something is coming to an end and a new beginning is about to begin. 
your family rooted in to the earth so you are grounded and you're aware of this foundation that you're laying for your life in some in some way um, and if this resonates for you you'll know what spirit is saying here what are you rooting your life into what are you grounding yourself in right now the moon cycle is coming across here as very important. So this week, you might want to check the moon cycle, see what's going on with your chart in the moon cycle. And there's some significant things going on here I'm seeing for some of you. Now, the world can also mean travel. So it means that you might be traveling. And we also had the energy of a journey here. So this means travel, a journey. You are moving from one place to another place. The tower energy. Now, I feel that this is below you here. We have the placement below you. And I feel that this is significant in this read for you. So the tower here below you, I feel that there's been a disruption. There's been an event. There's been something sudden that has happened or occurred in your life recently that you've really had to deal with it. It's taken your focus away from perhaps play, joyfulness, gratitude, and it's really been draining your energy or it's been a, a focus. And so I'm seeing that because it is below here, I'm seeing that that is coming to a close. The cycle is now ending with the world on top here. I feel that's important for someone to know that this that this event circumstance here, the tower, the destruction, the argument, the tension, the disruption, the difficulty is in fact uh, moving into the past now. It is not um, it's not moving ahead with you into this new cycle. And we have the two of pentacles. Now, this can mean that there are some choices that you're going to be making this week about material things, maybe possessions, maybe purchases. Um, it can also indicate a decision um, around a relationship as well. Um, that's very significant that I'm seeing here with it connected to the world card. The Queen of Swords. Now, this energy may be someone else that you are having interactions with. Someone who is cold towards you, non-emotional, someone who is quite harsh with their words or straight to the point. It may be an authority figure. It could be a boss or something like that. Um, but there is a feminine energy here that uh, you'll have to be working with or some of you will be working with. Now, I'm also seeing this energy as some of your energy here, Aries. I'm seeing that there is a uh, you're going to be perhaps a little bit more emotionally distant to a person this week or a situation that's been weighing on you. And I feel that it's linked in here to the tower. I feel that this disruption, this tower breaking down, um, this dismantling of energy whatever this represents for you, you'll know about it because it can be quite dramatic. You are distancing yourself from that. And the consequence of this here happening is you being more distant and you being um, perhaps not as open or as um, or as vulnerable as you have been in the past. You're thinking more with your mind rather than connecting into your heart. And I'm not saying that that's necessarily a bad thing here because you're still ha you still have a lot of gratefulness here. You can see the abundance coming in. You can see the changing of the cycle for you. Um, so I just feel that it's it's more of a progression naturally from this point here, which may have been quite um, difficult or traumatic. And we have the Ace of Rods. So you're really um, moving moving forward here with some important business, really important business. And you'll get the opportunity to carry this energy forward. It's not just going to be for this week. Um, so whatever it is that you're starting out this week, you're starting something new. It's a new cycle that's beginning. You'll be able to carry this energy through. Um, with you into the future. It's not just going to be for this week. I feel that you are, uh, yes, carrying this cycle forward and you know that you need to um, perhaps work on some things or you have to um, to get things right, to get things um, maybe back on track or to get things sorted in the way that you would like. And that's okay. You'll work with that energy. 
I am seeing here that it's um, going to follow you forward. Um, this new start will be for the longer term, basically, is what I'm picking up. I'm also seeing here on this card that there is a tendency here of play. You can see this, um, this person here on, um, it's kind of a making a makeshift bridge here and it's kind of to me it looks like it's um she's playing and I'm also connecting that in here with the play card so I really feel that it's important to enjoy your what you're doing this week enjoy this change enjoy this cycle change enjoy this shift in energy it's really important that you take um take time to do this and to just um have fun and to enjoy yourself um, because it looks like the business part of things is over in a way. It looks like um, the, the, the documents have been signed, the conversations have been had, the difficulty that you've needed to overcome, um, you've overcome it. You know, that's what I'm seeing here. Everything's kind of sorted. Business has been sorted and you're moving forward now and you can kind of relax you can relax and you can enjoy yourself just that little bit more than you have been able to recently so enjoy the journey this week Aries enjoy this expansive energy it's like you're flying into a new you a new lifestyle a new way of thinking and you and there's something really new and harmonious that will bring harmony into your life that I'm seeing here and it's really powerful and very beautiful so enjoy the week ahead Aries I hope you have a wonderful week and I'll talk to you all again soon